Hey guys, welcome back. So we're here on another house sit. Excuse me for my face. I look kind of crusty dusty, but it's okay. But we're actually here in Baltimore, Maryland. And we were on a house sit for about seven days. We have Mr. Jesse himself. And we have Rocco. So those are our two pups for the um the week this is my well not my first time in dc this is my second time in dc i i actually uh went to dc when i was much younger so um but so this is my second time but actually really my first time you need wipes but pretty much yeah we're just gonna go and try to explore i don't know anything of the history in the city so i'm looking forward to i'm looking forward to um exploring the city and learning like you know the history behind the city So for this particular house sit, we, um, it's actually kind of like my first time where the owner kind of like went through everything with me. I met her last night. We had um, a, two discussions over the phone, two different times, two FaceTimes. I actually booked this sit probably um, maybe like four months in advance. So. Um, right now it is like a nation blizzard type coldness going on so we wasn't expecting the weather to be this way so it was kind of a hassle like getting here um a lot of flights were canceled um so i think it's like storm elliot i believe but yeah so we end up making it here and um safely thank god and um but yeah, so I met her last night and we discussed, uh, we had two different FaceTime conversations and before, you know, me coming here. So I always come in, like if I know, if I know I'm going to be traveling or if it's a long distance, um, to where it's not a local sit, uh, what I'm saying is that, um, I usually come in the, in the day before so that in a situation like this where flights were canceled or whatnot it still give us some leeway so she was able to leave um she had a flight early this morning so it worked out everything worked out perfect um we actually stayed at an airbnb which is maybe about two and a half three miles away from here so it was very convenient we um yeah basically she just picked me up i met the dogs and um showed me around everything and uh, let me show you how she labeled everything so so um usually you'll have like uh some houses every house it is not going to be the same um, but i just want to show you guys so she went ahead and labeled everything there's labels here so pretty much you know when i first got to kind of get here i mean I'm, I'm pretty sure i will get like comfortable with um you know being here for a couple of days but everything is labeled here so it's no like guessing to try to figure out where everything is which is a very nice gesture um I like everything is labeled so it's just like these clear clear little post-its or whatnot but yeah so so like i was saying every house that every house is not going to be the same you're going to have sometimes some owners they're just going to like leave the key under the mat and that's it they're going to print you up a document and basically give you instructions and that's it but then you have some other owners that will take the extra step and label everything they take the time out to meet you be prior to you showing up at the house to be with the pups and it's kind of smart because it's kind of get a feel of um the sitter and the pet so so make sure you guys are subscribed and ring that notification bell because i will be posting part two of this video in a vlog series uh, my dc vlog series so yeah i hope you guys have enjoyed this video and i'll see you guys in the next one